Welcome! In front of me is a Redmi 12 and today I'll show you how you can enable and set up your Do Not Disturb mode. So to get started, pull down your notifications and swipe down once again to extend the list of toggles. Now, in those toggles, you're obviously looking for the Do Not Disturb toggle. If it's not on the first page, swipe to the left and you will see a second page or even a third one. But I already did see that the Do Not Disturb mode is right over here. Now it's shortened to DND, so once you see this little toggle, you want to hold it first time around and this will quickly take you to the settings. And here just scroll down and you'll have all the options. So a little bit lower, I guess. Notifications, where is it? Ah, there we go. Do not disturb. So as you can see, it's a uh, specific well, section right here with an off option. And when you actually tap on it, it gives you the, uh, the settings. So here we have the toggle on and off, which you can also do by just tapping on this right here, as you can see. Uh, we have one device locked, so meaning that the, the mode will only function when it's enabled, when you lock the device and don't use it. Then you have notify about calls, anyone contacts favorites or no one. Then below that we have a option for repeated callers. So if someone calls you twice within a 15 minute period, they will be bypassing whatever you have selected right here. And that's, well, there's only one last option, which is the schedule mode. And here you can simply add one. You can name it whatever you want, start, end time, then repeat which day of the week, check mark, and that's it. It's now set. You can set as many as you want. Uh, and when you want to use your schedule mode, just make sure that it is toggled on in here. And that's all you'd need to do. Now, for everyone else who wants to use it manually uh, on like random occasions, find the toggle once you set it up and simply tap on it like so. And you're good to go. Now, one important thing to keep in mind is when you enabled it manually, like I just did, you also need to remember to turn it off. Otherwise, the mode will be running indefinitely in your background. And obviously, to turn it off, you just tap on a toggle once again. Stop. There we go. So, with that being said, hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.